Hello, my people. Welcome once again. If you are joining me for the first time, my name is Agility. And uh, here I always um, talk about uh, how to win uh, win sports betting, how to play sports betting and always win. So if you are joining me for the first time, this is your opportunity to learn how to play bets and always win. And today we are going to be talking about how to hack Bet Niger, how to hack Bet Niger Zoom Soccer. Zoom Soccer is a virtual um, virtual football virtual football section of one uh, Bet Niger. So today, if you are joining me, we are going to be talking about how to hack Bet Niger Zoom Soccer. So stick around, and then um, if you've not subscribed to this channel, kindly subscribe to this channel and uh, hit this um, subscribe to this channel, hit the notification button, so that each time I update or post new videos, you will be the first to get notifications. Now, without wasting your time, let's get down to business. Now, if you open, um, if you open Bet, Bet Niger, this is what it looks like. I'm opening from the the Bet Niger shop. This is the one that looks more, more, uh, more visible. That has more options than every other one. So here you are going to see that these are the lineup of matches that are going to start immediately now. So what you are going to do is you first of all you select you select a game here when you select a game here you go to the you go to the table so when you get to the table you look for the ones that are, i don't know why this thing is taking time to boot up okay let me go back let me go back i don't know why it's taking time to to come up now let me go back again fine it has opened so when this opens what you have to do is you go to um the table now when you come to the table here you will see that man city is at the top of this table you understand so you've seen that man city is at the top let us go back to man city and see how many times they have now if you look here you can see that man city have won all their five last matches they have not lost any of their last five matches now come down to the base here you will see that leads is at the down of the is at number 20 they have won only one match and lost they didn't even draw they lost all their matches except only one winning now apart from leeds another person another um another team that has lost also is west ham west ham has lost all their matches apart apart from one the same thing happens here in norwich norwich has d d drawn one match won one and then lost three now, when you come to this point, you will have to go back. You go back. You go back to the uh, this thing. You look for Man City. Here is Man City Everton. Man City is playing Everton today. Now, Man City is going to play Everton. And Everton has won only one match. Drawn um, two matches. And then they have lost two matches. And Man City is playing Everton. Man City has never lost any match. And Man City is playing at home. Now, going by this calculation, it is very simple that Man City is supposed to win Everton. But now, if you go to the table, you will see that Everton is at number 12. Everton is at number 12 for this current season. Let's look at last season. Last season, Everton ended at 6. Everton ended at 6. So what is going to happen is that Everton, this is, um, Everton is going to, Try as much as they can not to go below 8 or 9 in this current season. So what you are going to do is you are going to hit Everton to win Man City. I've tried this several times and it has worked. Let's look at, let's look at their results. I've tried this several times and it worked. What was last um, Everton's last, last match? This virtual, let me see. Let me see if I can see it. Everton won West Ham in their last match. Can you see it? So Everton is climbing up. They are going up, trying to make sure that they don't go below that 8 or 9. That is how these bookmakers make their money. So now you are going to be picking, you are going to be looking at Man City to win Everton because Man City is, Man City's current form is very, very okay, more than Everton. So now in this situation, what you are going to do is you are going to pick Everton to win Man City from away. 
is relatively high. You don't expect it to come. The odds are high. You pick Everton to win Man City. Now you come to this place, Liverpool, Newcastle. Look at their match. Look at their match. This is a, it's, it's a trick I have tried several times and it has worked. So that's why I am recommending it to you. Try it and you are going to also thank me later. And um, if you try this and it works, kindly um, drop a comment in the comment section. Um, tell me thank you or tell me give me tell me your experience how you how you found it. Just um, hit the comment section and then give me a comment so that I will know if you actually benefited from this. Now look at this. Um, Newcastle is playing Liverpool and Newcastle is at home. Now let us let's go to the uh, let's go. If you look at the statistics here, we we'll see that Liverpool is not in their best. Liverpool have lost two, one, two, and three, one. And those draws they drew against Everton. Now let us go to the table. If you can see here, Newcastle is at number 15 with 14 points. And they've won only one match. While Liverpool is at number 9. Now, this number 9 is the position where Everton is striking to come up to. Newcastle, look at the last season. Last season, Newcastle ended at 15. Now, current season, Newcastle is at uh, 15 as well. So, and the, 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 the season has gone so far. So, what happens is that Newcastle is going to beat Liverpool because they will not end at this 15. Newcastle is going to beat Liverpool and the odds are relatively high. If you look at that, you will see that the odds are very high and a lot of people will be thinking that, oh, uh, Liverpool is going to beat uh liverpool is going to beat newcastle probably because they are at home or probably because they look better but if you look from the um from here what these bookmakers make is that they give high odds to those people that they know that you are going to pick this is actually not real football this is virtual football so they have to make their money now when they give high odds they know that you are not going to pick that high odd you understand so what they will do is they will give very low odd to liverpool and then they will give a very high odd to Newcastle, expecting you to pick from Liverpool, pick from Man City, and then you accumulate them, hoping that you are going to win the bet. So when you pick Liverpool, Newcastle to win Liverpool from home, how many odds do you have? You have 144 odds. Let's say you play it with um, 500 Naira. If you play it with 500 Naira, how much do you have here? You are having 72,462. I have tried it several times and it has worked. So try it this time, give it a try, and it's going to work. I just wish I could stay and um, follow it up and show you how it is going to work out now. But unfortunately, I cannot stay to, you know, follow it up and show it. There's another game here that looks very, very promising, but this is actually not going to go that way. This is Arsenal Norwich. Arsenal Norwich is not going to play exactly the same thing I predicted to you right now. Because Asna has a better position, is in a better position to win Norwich in this match. So thank you very much for watching this video and um, kindly apply the strategy that I've shown you now. And I uh, believe you me, you will have to thank me in the comment section. So I'll be looking forward to get your 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 comments. I'll be looking forward to get your reactions from the comment section if you won from this strategy. Thank you very much. Do have a blissful day ahead. See you once again.